This is Entrance Man. Unlike Exit Man, he's got time, money, and personality. This is Toilet Girl. She's terribly lonely. So lonely that she decides to end it all and jumps from her door. Entrance Man, the man with time, money, and personality, is entering the women's washroom for reasons unknown. He sees Toilet Girl falling and catches her moments before her death. They hadn't even had time to introduce themselves before Toilet Boy arrives on the scene. What the hell's going on? asked Toilet Boy. He hadn't seen a thing, but he also didn't need an answer. It was all pretty clear. Toilet Girl in the hands of Entrance Man with her skirt up. Entrance Man sensed danger, but before he could explain anything, Toilet Boy grabbed him. All of this was a shock to Toilet Girl. Toilet Boy had it terribly wrong, but that didn't matter. What mattered was that he was clearly jealous and clearly in love. This made Toilet Girl super happy. She forgot that she had ever been lonely and stepped aside to see how far Toilet Boy would take things. Actually, Toilet Boy was terrified and regretted grabbing Entrance Man, but there was no stopping now. He jumped on Entrance Man and started pounding away. He pounded Entrance Man black and blue, which made Toilet Girl even happier. All this time, she thought Toilet Boy didn't care for her, but now his true feelings were really coming out. She went back up on her door to get a better view of her hero, a better view of the one who had rescued her from loneliness, the one who was willing to defend her from evil, real or not real. And she also finally pulled her skirt back down. But this wasn't Entrance Man's first battle. He hadn't been on the toilet door his whole life like Toilet Boy. He had seen a few things in his time and had a lot of experience. And so he quickly turned things around and pounded Toilet Boy black and blue. Toilet Boy was already blue, so it wasn't much of a pounding. But Entrance Man wasn't out to hurt the kid. He just wanted to show him who's boss. But Toilet Girl didn't know this. She went white with fear. The boy who had loved her could be killed, and then she'd be terribly lonely again. It would be a disaster. She couldn't just sit there and let the future decide things for her. There was a flurry of pink. An entrance man was cracked in the back of the head. Now, entrance man can't be entirely sure, but he could have sworn that it was Toilet Girl who dealt him that blow. He looked to see if she was on her door. And she was. But her skirt was up again. What could have hit him so hard? He tried to think, but he felt so dizzy. And before he knew it, Toilet Boy was pounding away again. Toilet Boy hadn't been in a fight before, so he didn't know when to stop. He just kept pounding and pounding. Toilet Girl didn't mind this. It was better to play it safe than to lose her lover. Toilet Boy pounded the life out of Entrance Man, so much so that Entrance Man turned a deathly green. Finally, Toilet Boy realized he'd taken things too far. He quickly jumped back on his door to hide. But he was still black and blue, so it was all pretty obvious. Toilet Girl knew that Toilet Boy had it all wrong, but it was the thought that counted. The minute he was back to his regular color, she rushed to him. And that's why sometimes you see Toilet Girl and Toilet Boy on the same door together. As for Entrance Man, the life had been beaten out of him. He no longer felt like entering. It was too risky. Things could go terribly wrong, like today. And for the first time in his life, he exited. And he's been Exit Man ever since.